I guess you have to start a recording. Yeah, so now that recording is in session, so this is the April meeting for OpenGS Foundation. So back to you, Robin. Well, hi, welcome everyone. Thanks, Max. Um, let's get started, April. Uh, we're gonna meet some of our board members today, uh, talk about the election results, uh, go through last month's minutes, and then we'll hear from our CPC on an update and Kylie on marketing. Let's jump right in. So um like to share our uh, our board. You're going to be reading more about it in a blog next week. But we just had elections and the results came in uh, on Monday morning this week. So I would like to welcome our new members. Um, I'd like to welcome our new gold member who was just elected, Jordan Harband from Hero Devs. Congratulations, Jordan. That was an Thank open you. seat. Um, and if you'd like to give a quick intro yourself. Sure. Uh, my name is Jordan. I work at Hero Devs and uh, I do a lot of work with uh, open source and I have a bunch of NPM packages, work on the JavaScript standard and been participating in the OpenJS Foundation for many years. So I'm happy to continue that work. Great. Thanks. Um, also, the, uh, our remaining board members were, were re-elected. So all three from the CPC Toby, Joe, and Mateo all re-elected. You may know them um, from the work they're doing in the variety of, of committees. Um, we Our silver members were re-elected. Abby and Paula, also congratulations. Um, and Adrian, also re-elected as our end user representative. Um, and then for those who don't know, our platinum uh, members are appointed by their organizations. So uh, we have uh, an amazing board and I'm just so happy that so many of you work um, in so many of our programs and initiatives and we get to see you every week. So thank you. Okay. All right, Ben, take us through the minutes. Great, uh, we'd like to approve the minutes of the past uh, public board meeting. Uh, so would anyone like to make a motion? Motion to motion approve. To approve. <laughs> And I'll, great. I'll I suspect we're going to have a second. Thank you, Paula. Uh, great. Uh, any folks who are opposed? Any abstentions? Great. The motion has passed. Thank you. Okay. CPC update. Joe, Toby. Sure. I'll jump in. Um, uh, I'll work backwards. The Jest Charter was approved, uh, and the project graduated as of this morning. Huzzah! Fantastic! Oh, yay! Yay! Um, and then the Ecosystem Sustainability Program. Would anyone like to to touch on that? Sure, I can touch on that. Um, our Ecosystem Sustainability Program is something that was actually brought to us by Hero Devs, but it's open to any gold member of the OpenJS Foundation. Um, you've been hearing us talk a lot about outdated and unsupported uh, software that's out in the world. Well, sometimes as folks you know, need to move off of old versions or they're maybe stuck on an old version for a period of time, there's organizations um, out there who can help you uh, get up to date. and. Hero Devs as a gold member has been great to uh, propose a program that um, will take, um, they uh, they provide support, um, end of life, uh, never ending support to, uh, to open source packages for enterprise customers that need that support for uh, open source projects that are not maintained. Um, and they um, have graciously agreed to provide 15% of those revenues as a revenue share back to the foundation. So 10% of those revenues will go to uh, the projects uh, to control with it as they would, just as they would with any other crowdfunding budget, um, and 5% to the foundation. As you know, we're sort of like the product team around it that provide legal and marketing and program management support. So uh, really excited about this program moving forward. And thanks to the CPC and the board and all of our maintainers. So you'll be hearing more. All right, next up, marketing. Kylie. Hi, everyone. Okay, so social update this month. Um, not Nothing too crazy. Um, we just had a couple of posts here. Um, most exciting, uh, DECGLV9 was launched last month. 
Um, so lots of good stuff from that. Um, shout out to our friends at Foursquare and Cardo um, for working with us on that. Um, and I, I know it's April, so next month we're going to have a lot more exciting updates because we've been super busy in April. Um, so note that this is for March. Um, let's go to the next one um, for, for Node. Same thing here. Our, our April updates are a little more exciting, um, but most importantly, um, the Node.js website launched um, in March. Uh, super great redesign. This has been a long time um, coming. Um, so a big shout out to all of our contributors um, that helped on the website. Also, the Node.js documentary went live in March. Um, that is on YouTube. Uh, we worked with Honeypot on that. Um, so check it out. It's a good watch. Um, so not a ton of stuff besides that on social, um, but more good stuff coming um, in April and May. So uh, last week, uh, Robin talked at Open Source Summit North America in Seattle um, and gave a great talk on um, just security about your website and outdated software. Um, that's going to be available on YouTube in the coming weeks if you want to check it out. But along with that, we launched our Healthy Web campaign. So last, last fall, winter, I think it was December, we launched some research with IDC um, about websites that are out of date, um, notably um, using the jQuery software. And last week we launched our healthyweb.org website. So you can go in, check and see if your website is out of date um, on its jQuery. Um, and if it is out of date, it'll tell you and you can go to the jQuery website and take those steps to update. Um, so more coming on that uh, in the coming months, um, but for now, check your website um, and check, check your security, um, not just jQuery. So more to come there, um, but exciting launch for us. All right, and then one more call out. We, we talked about this a little bit in the last meeting, um, but we have our OpenJS Speakers Bureau that is out. Um, so we are welcoming our collaborators to self-nominate to speak at any JavaScript related or JSON conference. Um, you can find uh, the request form on our website under events. Um, it says Speakers Bureau. It'll take you to a Google form. Uh, you can fill that out and our program committee reviews those monthly. Um, so if you if you have an event you want to speak at and, and you'd like us to be involved and, and be funded, um, by us, uh, fill out that form and, and we'll contact you shortly after. That's all from me. So Robin, back to you. Great. Um, I think that wraps up unless we have any other business to share in the public session. No. Well, thanks everyone. Uh, really appreciate all that you do. Again, I get to see you all through the week. Uh, so that wraps up April. Max, do you want to officially close out the session? Yeah, this was a great session, especially for the security issue. I think that's such an important uh, problem in the blog. But we will see you, I guess, in May. Uh, we'll these see. things happen so fast. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Take care. Great. Ciao. Thanks, everyone. Take care. Thanks, Bye. Uh -huh. Thanks, everyone. Bye. Mm -hmm. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.